Did you hear about what happened with Barbie as of yesterday? Largest uh, Warner Brothers ever, right? Beating Past the Dark Knight. The biggest, most successful movie in Warner Brothers history. Woo! I still haven't seen it. I can't wait. Hey, welcome back to our stupid directs of Corbin. I'm Margot Robbie. You can follow us on Instagram and Twitter for more juicy content. Thank you to everybody sports on Patreon. Follow us on Twitter account and subscribe to the like button. Uh, today, obviously, welcome back. This is episode four of Guns and Gulabs. If you haven't seen the other three episodes already, uh, please do. Reactions, please go check those out. Obviously, it's already up on Netflix. If you're seeing this on YouTube, it's already on Netflix, so you can go check it out uh, and get ahead uh of our reactions um but if you're watching this on youtube obviously f as you saw in the first three episodes you're gonna see a cut up version five ten minutes uh very cut up footage for each episode um if you like to see the full uncut reaction of ours to each episode you can head over to patreon they're already up there for your viewing pleasure uh we are on episode four and this is called deal ya no deal i only have one expectation for this episode mm. a cameo by howie mendel Mm, probably. Yeah. I think that's most likely. Most most likely to happen. Um, but obviously, last episode, a lot uh, has happened. Last episode was a, a slower episode, uh, but a lot happened uh, in terms of... And we didn't mention, as you said, after we stopped filming, the triplets. Yeah. yeah. That's an interesting development. Yeah. Um, see what's going on with that, because um, that can't just be an accident that they're... Yeah, no, no, it's not an accident right. for sure, but it's interesting. Triplet. It made me think... Where did they reveal them earlier on in the first two episodes, and we just didn't pick up on it? Yeah, very dumb. <laughs> uh, anyways, let's just get back into this and see what we're going to see. Yep. yep. I mean, not much else to say other than that. That's true. I mean, you could say that a gulab is a really uh, creepy-looking dude who just tosses the ball to you. I would like a gulab. A gulab. I would like a gulab jamin. <gasps> Guns and gulab jamun. Someone's horny. ऐसे कैसे डॉक्टर को मारती हो? अब पापा जी का इलाज कौन करेगा? यार मैं सच में उससे मारने में एक कप चाय मिलेगी अंदरक वाले। मुझे पता थोड़ा लेट हो गया पर अगर बन सकता है तो प्लीज this is this is the real him at the core exposed right now TV Wow, when he finds out he betrayed him, his only friend. It's gonna, gonna, or was it her? That... Right, one of them. One of them did, and he's gonna. That's that's gonna be his. Uh, I, th I, I, my prediction is it'll be his Michael Corleone moment. Interesting. Nice opening. That's what she said. Why didn't she say that? I don't know. Well, they're lesbians. They're, yeah. <laughs> or they're into pegging. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, they're into pegging. <laughs> you know who else's kebabs are famous? Are <laughs> कोई किसी को पाने से कैसे मर सकता है? वो तो पूछना पड़ेगा किसी निशी से। That's a glove that. चल, कहाँ? शेर बोल। कब? अभी? क्यों? उसे ढूंढना भी जाना पड़ेगा। He's gonna break his glasses. Yep. Sweeney Todd. <laughs> 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 
Those were pies, so technically. So he has other motives for action. This has been on one shot for a while. Mm-hmm. First time he was in dad's chair. It's okay, I'm sorry, You're a good boy, Lal Krishna. My true friend and Gulab Ganj. Bye. I'll see you. You will eat? You will eat? I'm eating. Ganji Sahib, sick. Ah, sick. Okay. You're going to eat. Don't worry. These are my friends. They're special. So, they're going to test your test. What's your name? It's an X-ray and a test. Oh, what? You're going to do 4-5 X-ray. Whatever X-ray test, you're going to sit in line. Take it. You're going to be a lot of gang bars. He's so damn good. He's happy, look sad. I'll see you around. Man, I love watching them work. They're, she's really, really good. Bhavi, <laughs> 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 देखो 
मैं तुमसे बड़ा हूं तो बड़ा होने के नाते तुम्हें समझा रहा हूं तुम गलत जा रहे हो अपना नहीं तो अपनी फैमिली की सेफ्टी के बारे में सोचो सर जी जो माल जब्त किए हैं भी काफी जल्दी नहीं हुआ है ट्रिक्टम पीपल किसिंग ऑन दैट बुक आई एम रीडिंग द फाउंटेन हेड ओ तुम्हें एंड नॉट पसंद है या ही इज द बेस्ट वन ऑफ माय फेवरेट राइटर्स आई एंड रैंड एज अ फीमेल ऑथर ओह मैंने सिर्फ बुक पढ़ी मैंने ये नहीं ध्यान दिया कि राइटर मेल है या फीमेल और तुम्हें स्टोरी अच्छी लगी तो तुम्हें लगा कि मेल ही होगा है ना नहीं Oops. What are you taking? Don't touch the book bags cover, please. Why does that shot look familiar? Kanching anchor na patta baitha hua hai. I've seen another movie that oh, building right there. Looks familiar. Chhote Kanching ko to pata bhi nahi hai. Shukant to kya hal karega uska? अगर उसका माल उसे सही टाइम पे डिलीवर नहीं हुआ मैंने भी काफी कहानियां सुनी कलकत्ता वाले। नाइस nice शॉट। पता है। इसलिए खर्चा करके बाबू नो, आई पोस्ट। इट्स स्टिल नाइस शॉट। लेकिन किस्मत देखो या दैट वाज पोस्ट और स्पेशल। मैं सुगंतो के साथ तुम्हारी मीटिंग फिक्स कर रहा हूँ अगर तुम उसे मना सको ये डील तुम्हें देने के लिए तो मना लो आप क्यों करोगे मेरी भी तो सिर दर्द ही है सुकांतो से बात करके बताता हूं तुम्हें ये जो नारकोटिक्स का ऑफिसर आया ना नया रेड पर रेड मार रहा है किए इंग्लिश नॉवेल्स की पढ़ी जा रही है वो दिल्ली वाली लड़की का चक्कर है ना क्या हुआ दोस्ती हो गई एक लड़का और लड़की कभी दोस्त नहीं हो सकते दुर्गा आई चल चल Who's on his wall? Mujhe mat maarna. Chehra dekh apna. Sab nazar aa raha hai. That young Salman Khan at the top. I can't can't tell. Pata nahi kya plan tha jo papa batane ki koshish kar rahe the. Bol ke bhi to gir sakte the. Kuch bol rahe ho kya? Where he fell from? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Or narcotics? वाले का कुछ करना पड़ेगा. Cool lighting. आपका SP मिश्रा क्या कर रहा है? अक्तर को छोड़ दिया माल नहीं छोड़ा. लगता है उसे खुद जा के समझाना पड़ेगा क्यों किससे उलझ रहा है. Go back to that establishing shot with the table. I want to see the lighting again. There it is. जैसे आपने बोला था. मैं भी SP मिश्रा का पीछा करने गया था. हाँ. वो साला नबीत से मिलने गया था. नॉर्मल कोई लोकेशन में मीटिंग करना क्या बुरा लगता है आपको नहीं नहीं जगह सेफ है कोई ज़्यादा सीन हिम सिंस द द फर्स्ट एपिसोड या व्हेन ही हैड मीटिंग विद बहुत बड़ा ऑर्डर है अदर गाइस गांधी साहब कोमा में मरे नहीं है लेट्स फिक्स दैट ओह ओह Oh wow. It's a Mexican oh, shootout. Oh wow. Didn't expect this. Oh we got here's a Mexican standoff. He grew some brass balls, man. Ek baar to isne god mein mut diya. Abhi bhi mut sakta. Jab bhai sahab sadak se utha ke ghar leke aaye the. आपकी और पापा की डील तय हुई थी जबान दिया था ना आपने तो मुंह उठा के डील से पीछे नहीं हट सकते हो काम करने का कोई तरीका होता है कि नहीं अच्छा उसके बाद दूसरा जो बोल रहे थे क्या वहां के काम करने का एक तरीका होता ये तरीका सही लगा You got a grow up hair. देखो बेटा, तुम्हारे हालत देख के मैं बिना कुछ बोले जाने दे रहा था। लेकिन अब जब तुम इतना उछल रहे हो, तो तुम हमें ये महीना का एंड तक पूरा का पूरा डिलीवरी करेगा। 
ठीक है ना Playing with the big boys now. कांची और एसपी साहब को तो हम पहले ही नाराज कर चुके हैं अब नवीद के इलाके में रेड मारकर हम उससे भी नाराजगी बोल ले लेंगे तो उस गांची ने अकेले कोई पाप किया है क्या नवीद को क्यों छोड़े हम तो सारा माल घर का होंगे सर नहीं हम जब कर रहे हैं सर आपको साइन चाहिए बाद में अभी माल बस फैक्ट्री पहुंचा देखो भैया आप ये गलत कर रहे हैं नवीद के कुत्ते घूम रहे हैं उनमें से किसी ने पहचान लिया तो आज के बाद हमें कोई पहचान नहीं पाएगा चुपचाप चाय पीना वैसे भी बड़ा तो जो कोई पहचानता है निकल रहे निकल रहे दो जाता दो चाय दो रुपए टू रुपीस डैंग ये यहाँ पे कोई लंबा चोड़ा आदमी देखा क्या लंबे लंबे बाल हैं उसके इतने वो कल्लाइक जैसा कैसी डांस भाई सब मैं अपने दोस्त को ढूंढ रह I'm sure they all know who he is. Nice edit. To sach mein andar dalunga. Dal do andar. Are is karo. Kade kade dialogue kya de raha hai? Dal do andar. Get out. Chale chale. Galat kar raha hai sar. Kolkata ka sukan to Gulab Ganj aaya hai. What's his end game here? खरबूजा है। आदमखोर शेर के बारे में सुना है नहीं। तो? ये दुर्लभ ताबीज <laughs> ये नाखून उसी आदमखोर शेर का है अंबाला में छुट्टी होगी तो यहाँ आ गया दोनों मफलर निकालो जल्दी अरे आप लोग खेल देखो ना भाई कोई दिक्कत नहीं चले जाते हैं आराम से हम चले जाते मैंने कहा था ताबीज खरीद लो Remember those guns in Merzipur? Done. Oh, nice. Bravo. I think we saw that in the trailer. <laughs> Thank you. Visit again. <laughs> They're getting across the line. Yeah. I want to know what. I don't feel like it's. Ju he's not just. It's okay. Trying to do justice here. Yeah. Something else. Yeah. I don't know what. Arjun Verma. I know. Apu hai, jo is pure ilake mein shor macha hai. And screwing up my shipment. Or apu hai jo aajkal is ilake pe kuch zada hi mehrban hai. Isliye to ham tumko is film se se double offer de raha hu. Offer it, say. But there's a guy in prison I want you to get for me. Let me tell you something, Mr. Sukanto. In my experience, it's not what you need. It's not what you need. He can. Yes. So, who is it? 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 That's his end game. That is. Hey, man. Nice. Wondering what his end game was. Found it. Yep. But he doesn't seem to have any urgency about keeping the secret away from his wife. Because. Well, I don't think he's worried about it because he already found out like, who it was. And so. 
it, it's gonna I come guess, back, obviously. Uh, yeah. That guy and I get maybe he maybe he assumes she's gonna find out there's nothing I can do maybe about he's it. He's gonna try to loop that guy in. Maybe. So um, he doesn't. Right. Say, hey, if you don't reveal this, I'll let you be a part of this. Maybe. I don't know. Still, we haven't seen mullet guy this episode. Is he awake? <laughs> the music. The music. Fun, man. These episodes Again. Go, these episodes go by so fast. These episodes fly. I mean, I guess that's a it, good thing, right? it does. It feels like it's a it's a less than thirty minute episode. It's wonderful. Uh, yeah. Shut up. God. Oh my god. We're gonna solve this joke. (laughs) (sighs) Yeah, even though like it uh it wasn't as slow as the the last episode. No. But this one's moving a little better. But it it, it's still slower than than what it was. Uh and so that's what I said in the last one. Sometimes episodes three and four in a seven episode series are the slower ones because they're right in the middle. Right. They still have to we because st- we hadn't figured out what his motive was yet, Dul- Dulkers. Um, we yeah, things we are did, developing. We did still didn't see, we didn't see Mullet Guy. No, I don't think in this episode did we? I don't. Did we, no, I don't think we did. We did not. Um, so that that's the proverbial shoe that obviously Raj Kumar's character still has to f- figure out, and then now everything that's kind of going on with. Um, a Darsh's character. Yeah, they've got a lot of characters and a lot of storylines that are really easy to follow without exposition being put in the script and not putting you in a place of wondering, okay, what's going on? Where? Why haven't we heard from that? This is a really well written show. But I mean, it's them. So yeah, like Farsi was the same way. The, the, yeah, but uh, Family Man. But even with Family Man and Farsi, I don't remember there being so many different people being involved in things and going back and forth between them so often and not getting lost in it. You know, yeah, that's, it, that's it, tough it, to do. It is a more simple show in terms of like you can follow pretty easily what's going on, even though there are twists of that that you don't see coming right um but we've got at least six stories happening the kids we've got the kids going on and there's there's a love story within the kids not just what's going on with the kids so there's actually two stories going on within the kids Mm -hmm. we've got deepu's story about just his personal own stuff that he's dealing with but then there's also his love story Mm -hmm. then you've got uh, Adarsh's story, which is both a story about him handling the business as well as what's going on with him. Everybody seems to have stuff going on that's the larger picture, and then there's also an inner story about what's going on with them personally. Yeah, it's good writing, though. Isn't great it? writing. Um, Just great writing. You need to have fleshed out characters. and It's great writing. Um, that have more than one thing going on, because people have more than one thing going on. Exactly. So no, real. that's why these are not hollow shallow characters for for just entertainment purpose this is really really thought out fleshed out people because the editing is quirky at times the the score is probably the most quirky part of the show yeah they they incorporate so many different vibes yeah westerns horror there at the end yep um uh funny dramatic all these different like old school hindi uh, like uh, western music as well they kind of incorporate everything into the score and i I bet there's stuff we're missing too because you just growing up indian there's some things i'm sure they're throwing in there there was one spot i didn't say anything when it happened i can't reference it again but there was one spot where i thought i saw a mid-shot edit that like for some reason they they went from inside to outside no no that was that was clear it was an interior shot. It was when the guy who works with Dulkar, uh, at the he, who's working on both sides, the bad cop, right? He went to go visit after he had killed the doctor. It was early on in the episode, and he's talking to him as he's sitting in the chair about, you know, what did you think I can do? I can't just get you off on any little thing that you do. And it was a shot where he's on him, and he goes to him sitting in the chair. There was a minuscule, just 
little hiccup in the pan. And I thought, wow, I think they noticed something. They wanted the two takes that they got that were both the same shot. Like they had take one and they had take two. They wanted the first half of the take of the first shot. And they wanted the second half of the second shot. Mm -hmm. And there was no clean way to edit it except mid shot. And so they took the chance and got away with it. I, I no way to confirm that, but I could have sworn I saw that. I mean, there is a way. You can ask, well, ask Roger DK. Ask Roger DK. But if so, that was nearly flawless edit mid, mid shot. Um, but yeah, another good episode. I'm, I'm looking forward to the final. It's a fun show. I think it's the final three episodes. I think it's seven episodes, right? Um, overall. And a testament to, we haven't really talked much about uh, Dulcor's portrayal and his acting. Not only is he doing a superb job, but we know from Raj and DK, he jumped on board a week before production this started. Kind of crazy. That's really crazy. Um, and really has a very clear idea of who this character is. Very clearly. Um, I'm enjoying the score. I'm enjoying the editing. I'm enjoying the pacing. I'm enjoying the characters. Yep. I'm enjoying the show. It's a good show. Um, is this the third show of the year for us, or the fourth? Farzy. This. Are you including anthologies? No, that's not, okay. those aren't shows. Okay. So, obviously, Farzy, this, uh, Jubilee. Jubilee. Was there another one that we had seen this year so far? I don't think so. I think I don't think so. Okay, cool. That yeah, was, it was Jubilee Farzi in this one. Okay, cool. Um, all very different, obviously. And two very of the different. exact same directors. Uh, <laughs> yeah, uh, and this is very different very from different Farzi. Farzi. It'll be interesting to see um, uh, when it, once it ends um, how they compare, uh, which ones we like better, because we really enjoyed Farzi. That's really cool. When you compare the three shows that they've done, of Family Man, Farzi, and this, they're so different. You'd think it's completely different creators. Yeah. That's awesome. The only through line is that it's good quality. And crimes involved. And they said family man. In this. And they did say family man. Yeah, that's <laughs> a good quality, crimes involved, and that's about it. Yeah. And, and uniformly really good casting across the board in all their shows. Um, I was going to ask them this, uh, but we were having technical difficulties at the end, so we didn't get to ask this, the, the questions and do the rapid fire. Yeah. But um, I was going to commend them, and I know you would have too, for, for getting the white actors right in Farsi. Oh, yeah. Remember? Yeah, I was going to talk to them. Oh, yeah. Because there's like the, the best white actors we've seen. We've seen, except for Mark Bennington. Yeah, exactly. Yep. Uh, anyways, another great episode. Looking forward to the final three episodes, obviously. If you're watching this on YouTube, obviously you saw a very cut-up version. If you'd like to see the full uncut version of this episode and others, you can head over to Patreon. Patreon, oh, Patreon. Uh, the show is over there. And you can see the full uncut versions there. I'll put the link in the description below and the pinned comment. And on to the next episode.